What's up, LND gang? It's your boy D-Bone, you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn the notification bell on. And if you've been before, make sure you hit that like button because you know it's about to get lit. Alright, so Essie, about the title we are react to, Bill Burr, how you know when the N-word is coming. Here it, let's get it. Get straight into it. Right, I'm ready. Because I missed a Bill Burr since last week. Okay. It's like to be back here down the south, man. I had a real weird experience last time I came down here. I was in Nashville, right? right sort of an awkward right. social situation, right? right? I'm sitting at this bar. There's this white dude sitting like two stools away. I don't know him. He doesn't know me. And that Terrell Owens story was in like sports news. So I try to make conversation. I'm like, man, look at this guy. This guy just signed a $40 million contract. He's already bitching, man. How much money do you need <laughs> right. to make? Right. And the dude looks at me. He's like, you know what I say? And then he looked over his shoulder, which I now know is the telltale sign that the N-word is coming. And it's coming hard. Right, it's coming hard. Oh yeah, it's not going to be pronounced with the A, it's going to be with the R. And he hit the R, he like stuck the landing. It was like a dismount, clan members high-fiving in the background, like with the wave. Just out of nowhere. So now immediately I'm looking over my shoulder like, dude, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> I hate when people do stuff like that. That dude made me part of like a potential ass kicking that I had nothing to do with. You don't do shit like that. He just had that word hot potato just threw it my lap. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> right, look at that. He's saying it now. I'm not good. <laughs> you know, those people get like so mad they're not even looking at you. Their eyes are open. You just shut up and play the game. <laughs> you know what's funny? I don't even like Terrell, but now I love the guy. Because every time I see him talking trash, I know this idiot in Nashville is just so losing his mind, right. like kicking over his kitchen TV. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Black people, he's so right. I don't know what happens to me if I see it live. I like watching it on TV, you know? Watching people, you know, get attacked by animals. <laughs> Just get blasted in the face or something, you know? Like, I'm a huge sports fan. You know, my favorite, like, moment of, like, the last year was in sports that Detroit oh, Piston, wow, Indiana Pacer, Bench Clever Crawl. Wasn't that great? That was one of the greatest things I've ever seen. I was so confused when I watched ESPN that day. They were like, that was absolutely disgraceful. Basketball fans, yeah, 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 just must be a <laughs> I'm sitting there like, I'm a basketball fan. I love it. I thoroughly enjoyed watching out of shape civilians get the shit kicked out of them by professional <laughs> athletes. It was fascinating. And I think as sports fans, we kind of had it coming, right? Because how many times you go into a game, right? You got a little too drunk. You started screaming at some dude on the field who could clearly kick the shit out of you, right? If you saw him in the parking lot, you'd be like, hey, can you sign my stamp collection? I think you're awesome. Right. You get in the game, you're all drunk, you're like, you suck, buddy! You're a piece of shit! And they're always calling him up, come on up here! No, come on up here! No, come on up here! They came up there! They did, they kicked the shit out of everybody, it was great. It's like a cartoon. You're like beating up whole rows of people at once, like... I loved every second. I love how Ron Artest punched the wrong guy. Wasn't that great? He taught that dude a valuable lesson in life. When shit goes down, you don't just stand there like you're watching a movie like, wow, it's coming right at me. 
<laughs> it was a five foot six inch, hundred and ten pound white dude had an angry six foot ten inch black dude running right at him. That had to have been in his top three nightmares yeah, all time. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> top three nightmares all time. Get cut off and being lit on fire. And he just stood there. He's like trying to explain himself. Well, I still have the liquid in my cup, so there's, there's no way I can. <laughs> 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 I know. He's Period. I mess up everywhere though. And then I, I about to say apparently, what was the other one we seen on? Was it on the that Shaq comedy? Because apparently that's a YouTube channel to just like put the, you know, his clips, clips on there. On there. <laughs> you know, but y'all saw reaction. Comedy Shaq. Right, I think it was funny. Y'all saw the reaction. Y'all let us know in the comments what you guys think about the video. Make sure you guys and leave in the comments any more billboard clips or you know segments that you want to see from us. Make sure you guys like this video, share this video, subscribe to this channel, hit that notification bell so you're notified every time we post a brand new video. Also follow our social media at the top of the bottom of the screen and follow us on TikTok. And hit that notification bell so you're notified every time we post a brand new video. Comment down below. Hashtag LMD Gang if you want to shout out our next video. We're back, back more videos. videos.